everybody. <laughs> Jeff has an eggplant. We're making two recipes from Stardew Valley. Uh, Jeff is gonna be playing Stardew Valley. I'm mean, not speed running. I, I love, 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 love Stardew. And I have tons of recipes from Stardew. No polo kanji. No polo kanji. This is for our eggplant parmesan. The most important thing is making sure that they're roughly the same thickness. The main reason I'm putting them in this strainer here is I want to make sure to kind of pull out a little bit of the moisture. Uh-oh. Kanji, stay right there. I left the treats in the other room. There you go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Slobbery boy today. So I have a pile in there. I'm going to go ahead and sprinkle a little bit of salt. No, Kanji, what are you doing? Up. Oh. I swear, I think he knows that the treats come from y'all. So a little bit of salt there. What is your face? Oh, you're a duck man. So the last thing we're gonna do with this for a little bit, I'm gonna go ahead and put another plate on it and then I'm gonna put some weight on it. So it kind of like helps push any of that extra moisture. The two marinara sauces I'm gonna need for later. Salt likes to pull out moisture of things. That's one of the big roles of salt. You be so handsome. You getting little pets. We got some goose crimes happening. You found an artifact. You're on anime farm? His favorite thing is not anime. Wow, wow. This has flour, garlic powder, salt, pepper. This is three eggs with um, some milk. This one back here is just panko, some oregano, and some thyme. Just give it a little extra seasoning there. Place it in the flour first. We want to make sure to cover it real nice. Ta -da! So you just put it in there. You want to make sure that it's not like dripping wet. All right, now I go ahead and put this in and then I go ahead and cover it. Oh, oh but look at what we get on this side of the camera. The elusive flipped kanji. <laughs> what a blessed stream. <laughs> oh, you spooked him. So we've had our oil heating for a bit. We just want to get it golden brown. So about two minutes per side. We don't want to like overcrowd this either because that will like reduce the temperature. Yeah, I could, I should have waited. Some of it's crisping up. So yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna need a little longer than two minutes for these first few. I've upped the temperature, so that's gonna bring that up a little bit more. So we're gonna go ahead, do another set. This is the one that's like extra thick. Jeff just said the slingshot's terrible and immediately put it in the trash. Hey, 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 hey. Did he hear the dog in the game? Oh, he's going to the front door. He has to have a word with the front door. So now we're gonna prep the baking dish. Real nice and simple here. So what we're going to do is put a nice layer of sauce at the bottom. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna stack our eggplants in a row. And we'll cut some in half when we need to, to like, fill in specific holes. And then what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna add some mozzarella and then I'm gonna add some of the Parmesan and then we're gonna add marinara. We always have to have a little warning. Do not watch while hungry. So now I'm gonna cover it with a layer of like this basic cheese. This is Parmesan again. Nope, I got it. I usually have to just say Jeff help and then it opens. So this layer of sauce I'm being a little more aggressive with than the other, the other two. So we got like some shredded mozz and then some fresh mozz. This is a piece of fresh mozz. You want some fresh mozz? No, uh-uh. Tacos, go get it. This is a trick for my mom. So we wanna cover this. And something I've learned with covering things is if you do the aluminum foil first, it's gonna stick onto stuff. So I went ahead and covered that in plastic wrap and then I'm gonna cover it in aluminum. The plastic wrap will not melt. It'll be completely fine. But what that helps with is the cheese will not stick to stuff. So this is just going in here, 30 to 45 minutes. Jeff just called himself Tony Hawk. So, you know, that's the life he's living now. This sauce, the rest of the sauce that we have here, we're gonna use just to Coat the pasta in. Once that gets going. He did pretty 
And you have to, oof. It's called progress mode that you have to keep restarting. You gotta believe. Oh, you're changing games. Dang. One set of kanji pets, please. Going by the doors is very risky. This is his uh, Dark Souls skills coming back in. Yep. Why'd I say something? Yeah, boss level. Oh, no! You, <laughs> you took each other out! <laughs> Howdy, partner. We're back at the boss fight, so we're back where we were. With four lives. Okay, yeah, going a lot smoother this time. They're carrying you off. Oh. Oh, those are mummies and skeletons and, like, gargoyle imp things? Oh, I don't like this. I'm gonna add a bit of salt. I have sugar, lemon, juice, uh... Rice vinegar, just regular rice vinegar, and uh, olive oil. I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of pour that in. Again, don't have the cilantro, so usually there would be cilantro also in this. And then we're gonna add, just for like additional like texture and stuff, some sesame seeds. That's the salad. See? Easy peasy. Excuse me? Oh, excuse me? What happened? Oh my gosh, no. Ooh, that's not good. Oh, uh, why are you trying to destroy the pure heart? Booger doo doo. They said the pure heart. Wait, you... I beat it. Did you beat it? Yeah. You sure? Oh, you got an achievement. You got an achievement on my account. Oh, pasta. Cause I forgot. I, I had forgotten about the pasta. Or what? Kissing. Got a kiss. Oh, here you go. Don't let chat down, Jeff. Huh? We're going to go ahead and remove this. And as you'll see, we have our plastic wrap on here that comes off real easily and does not attach itself to the cheese. So your cheese doesn't end up getting stuck stuck on things. So we're gonna let that go for a few minutes. I cooked up the pasta real quick. This is the spinach noodles. Okay, now I'm gonna just put the sauce in here. Ta-da! Simple noodles. Put your hands here. Whatever. It's on there. We're not going super fancy. It's just dinner for Jeff and me. Ta-da! I'm gonna let that sit for a little bit just so it kind of like solidifies up. I'm just kind of grab an amount. <laughs> Stretchy cheese. So that's what we made. It's the eggplant parmesan. And then this is our radish and cucumber salad. This is our dinner. And Jeff said he's the king of the prairie. I'm trying to think what else might have been said. So yeah, thank you all for watching. Thank you for being here. Thank you for enjoying all the food I made. Thank you all for stopping by. Have a nice evening. Where's all my other stuff? Oh my goodness. I, all my buttons have changed. Good night.